Welcome to our first video in the series. In this video, we're going to show you how to set up your account. Um, we are going to be using the tool called Unreal Engine, which is an engine that is used in industry for quite a few things. It used to be known as a game engine, so to make video games like the ones you see on the screen. Uh, probably the most famous video game that everybody knows and plays is Fortnite. Uh, but Unreal Engine has been used to create uh, a lot of famous games, a lot of VR famous games uh, that are out there. Uh, so it's a it's quite a versatile tool. And uh, you students are going to be using this exact same tool. So they'll be introduced to the tool and they'll in be introduced to uh, using some high-end graphic uh, components that are built into the engine. Which, by the way, if you were some kind of private uh citizen who wanted to use this, you would end up having to pay for a lot of the tools that uh, we're going to use. But uh, uh, Epic Games, who owns Unreal Engine, uh, provides those uh, packages or software free for education, which makes it extremely uh, interesting and fun to use. So uh, I want to start by uh, maybe a shout out. So the first thing is uh, Epic Games just recently allowed multiple sign-ins. So, and I was the one who requested that, but I'm sure it wasn't the only one because it used to be that you were only able to use this tool uh, with uh, an Epic game account. Now, a lot of us like teachers like myself uh, really wanted us to be able to use uh, do domain sign-ins. For example, at our school board, we use sign-in with, uh, with Google app account. So that's what I'm going to do. So the first step. Uh, but I'm going to go back for a second here just to show you something. So there's quite a bit in here uh, that is really uh, useful, and I won't explore too much of it. Maybe I'll have a video on this later. But there's a whole e-learning section that is extremely powerful, and you could really come a long way, uh, including my grade 11 and 12 students. Uh, I've used this to uh, help them in their game concepts. Um, I'm just going to mention we're going to be using uh, Unreal Engine mostly for concept art and maybe a little bit of cinematics. Uh, and the thing is, Unreal Engine is not just used for gaming. It's used in the TV industry. It's used in the movie industry. It's used in uh, the engineering community. Uh, it's a very versatile tool. All right, so let's go to the first part. And how do we create an account? Well, it's pretty easy. You sign in. Now. Preferably, you're already signed into your school account. And what I recommend that you do is you make sure you use the account that you can use at school. So what we're going to do is I'm going to use this one, which is my school account, ocdsb.ca. And now I am in. Now, this is for the teacher, the certain uh, message, I guess. The thing is, in the Unreal Engine, there's quite a bit of uh, stuff like related to gaming and all that. Um, now, I've never had any issues in my class, the students, uh, as long as you are uh, keep them well engaged and have a structured lesson. Um, now they're making games. They're going to be making a game environment. And in fact, in this tutorial, we're going to teach them how to make a game environment similar, and it could be used in a actual real video game if they wanted to. Okay. Uh, but what we're really interested in is installing the latest version of Unreal Engine. So we're, that's what we're going to do. If uh, you haven't already done it, you're going to have to install the game launcher. Um, you will have to use the same account. And uh, I will just demo that in two seconds.